of dirty cows in off-paddock facilities is how long they spend inside the facility. As a hybrid system adjusts around the season, cows can spend more or less time inside. Inside a freestall barn, ensure that every cow has the opportunity to lie on a dry, clean bed. This will be achieved by ensuring there is one stall for every cow. The length of the stall to the average size of your cow will also affect the dirtiness. Shorter cows will defecate on the back of the beds, which other cows can potentially lie in. Longer cows will have their tail lying in the passageway, which effectively acts as an effluent paintbrush, where you often see cows with effluent on their backs from this situation. Keeping on top of effluent in the passageways is essential. This is done by setting the scrapers to match the volumes produced. Volumes produced are affected by the number of cows in the facility, time in the facility per day, and diet. Diet change or diet type can affect the looseness of cow feces. Watery feces tends to make more of a mess, can splash onto cows and creates larger volumes that need to be managed. Adjust your scraper timing as usage of the facility or diet changes throughout the season. Free store mattresses without bedding does mean that mattresses will become and stay wet. There are many different bedding types. Some are more absorbent and easier to manage than others. In loose house systems, cultivation and topping up of the surface layer and the stocking rate all affect how dry and clean the top layer of a wood chip pad will stay. Management tips include cultivate daily when in full use, Top up when moisture levels start making cows dirty and stick to recommended stocking rates. It is important to understand how to keep your cows clean regardless of the type of off-paddock facility you have. 